All right, Rock's debuggy. All right, One Piece theorist. You're not going to click your move, are you? That's fine. That's fine. You're just increasing the runtime of my video. Everyone, comment total garbage. Oh, man. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to another Pokemon Scarlet and Violet VGC 2023 Showdown Live video. So, uh, I, I've decided, yeah, we're going to start with the Reg D content. I've been kind of putting it off because I'm like, okay, am I going to get burnt out if I start too early? But yeah, I mean, I've been doing the moveset guides. We're going to move on to uh, actually battling now. So yeah, um, we're hopping on my main account. I haven't laddered a ton in Reg D. I actually played like some games just when in a call with friends. What's my ladder? 1310. Oh, I have to wait. I played 49 games. Oh my God. I did not realize. Okay. Well, yeah, I've just been testing a whole bunch of different things, but uh, this is a team that I've been running uh, on ladder and I, you know, did pretty decent in a rune tour with it, but uh, it's Basque Legion. So yeah, uh, before we get into it, if you guys enjoy this standpoint in time, do me a favor, leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel and turn notifications because I bring you daily competitive Pokemon content. Answer my comment question of the day, which is what Pokemon do you want me to build around next? Anyways, uh, let's just go into the team and just break it down. If you want like an in-depth breakdown of the team, I'll probably post it to my Patreon at some point this week. Uh, but yeah, so we have Basque Legion. Just, you know, I, I just optimized the uh, Life Orb recovery or the Life Orb um, recoil. So I'm not taking max damage from that each turn. Uh, and we're hitting enough speed out speed Regieleki specifically. We have a bulky Covert Cloak Thunderous. Um, it's enough. So if we were to Thunder Wave a uh, Iron Bundle, we would outspeed it and then be able to follow up with a Wild Bolt Storm. We have Pelipper with Wide Guard, Tailwind, Hurricane Protect. It's Terra Ghost, by the way. These are Terra Water, Terra Grass. But uh, I went with Terra Ghost because I don't know what else to run on this. I figured it'd be useful. I might end up just running Terra Flying, to be honest, because uh, it'll just power up my Hurricanes. But yeah, we're just Safety Goggles, Max Max, Wide Guard, Tailwind, Hurricane Protect. Uh, very, very basic. Um, and the reason we're Safety Goggles on this is because the Focus Sash is taken. Uh, we have Sash on Chen Pao. We have Sucker Punch Haze, Protect Ice Spinner, Terra Ghost. We have a Terra Water Rillaboom with Fake Out U-Turn Water uh, Wood Hammer and Knock Off. I'm considering swapping it for Terra Fire, um, but then I'd be weak to Water types, which I don't know if I really like that. And also, then I'm weak to Ground types. So then again, he can deal with it. So like that's something I'm just kind of workshopping right now. Um, but yeah, uh, and he's just running like standard set. We have our Golden Go, which is just Specs. We're outspeeding Regieleki. Actually, what I'm going to do is just make it one point faster than Basque Legion because that'd be annoying if I was speed tying my own Basque Legion. Yeah, uh, it's going to be one point faster than Basque Legion and the rest is just thrown into bulk. Uh, we have Make It Rain, Shadow Ball, Trick, Thunderbolt, and we're just going to one shot things with Terra Steel. Let's get into it. Let's grab some games. All right, uh, hopefully we can face something kind of cool. Uh, yeah, this is pretty cool. This is pretty cool. BLHF. Uh, I mean, hopefully they open up the team sheet so I can know what kind of Urshifu it is because I right now, you know, I can't tell. Um, I think into this, the Basque Legion lead isn't the worst, right? It's it's not the worst thing ever, but also the Golden Go lead could absolutely annihilate them if I play my cards right. So I'm thinking what I want to do here is I'm going to go for like endgame Basque Legion and I want to lead off with the Golden Go. Golden Go Rillaboom seems like a really solid pick. Um, I can probably pick up some very, very easy KOs with that if I play my cards right. Uh, Golden Go Rillaboom. Let's go with the Basque Legion in the back. And I actually quite like Pelipper here. I think it's going to be very useful. And it looks like they don't want to open up the team sheet. So yeah, that's the lead that I wanted. Let's see whose Rillaboom's faster. Their Rillaboom is faster, um, but it shouldn't really be an issue here. I'm just going to immediately go for the Make It Rain uh, in Terra Steel. And I'm going to go for the Fake Out onto their Rillaboom, assuming they want to Fake Out me. And I want to just try to pick up this KO ASAP. Cool. I'm going to get some decent damage there. I might even just one shot because I'm specs. Not quite a one shot, um, but enough where they don't want to stay in. So I'm going to go for a second, make it rain. I should be faster than this Rillaboom with my Golden Go. I don't think that they're going to be max speed. I'm not really scared of a Fluttermane one shotting me. So I'm going to go for another make it rain as well as a U-turn into this Fluttermane to get my Rillaboom off the field because they may want to pivot into something that can eat the hit better. And Rillaboom isn't going to be able to protect. They're typically Assault Vest. Also, we're Speed Tide. That's what we learned here, because the opposing Rillaboom's grassy uh, surge went up first. So yeah, that's that's pretty funny. We just happen to be the same speed tier, 110. Oh, they're Terra Water. Okay, well, that isn't the best for me. They do crit me, but I am going to get some pretty massive damage off here. 
Um, and they no longer resist the U-turn, so that's going to be pretty okay. I can get in my Basket Legion now. And I threaten a one-shot on a lot of things. This Fluttermane will certainly not be able to eat this hit, but also now I'm scared of this Urshifu, which I don't like. I actually really don't like that. Um, let's get in my Pelipper here. And I think if I want to avoid getting KO'd by this Urshifu, because they're going to Sucker Punch me, right? Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Do I have to double? Okay, so they're gonna sucker punch the Urshifu, or they're gonna sucker punch the Basket Legion slot 100%. And they might just want to go for a Dazzling Gleam here. So I'm gonna get in my AV Rillaboom and my Pelipper. In the next turn, I might be able to get a Tailwind off. They just wicked blow me. Oh my god. As they also do that. Okay, interesting. I don't know why you do that. Glacier in the back? I can deal with that. Okay. Yeah, that's weird. I don't understand that at all. I really don't. Um, I should be scared of a Sucker Punch on my Pelipper. So I think here it's going to be in my best interest just to try to... What if he Scarf? Let me think. 83%. Um, I don't know. All right, let's just try to KO this guy. I'm going to double into him. Hopefully I don't get Sucker Punch. That's going to be important. All right, they do have Sucker Punch. I'm going to be doing a decent amount of damage. And now I have Basket Legion in, but I am now subject to getting Sucker Punch, which really sucks. Um. Oh my God, how do I get out of this? No wonder they didn't want to open up the team sheet, bro. <laughs> All right, uh, let me get in my Golden Go here. And I'm basically forced to just go for it, man. Oh, I really hate that. Uh, let me U-turn on the Glacier to try to get some... Try to get some, uh, what's it called? Fake out stuff next turn. With any luck, they won't be able to one-shot me, but they might. It's a pretty powerful Pokemon. Yeah, they're going to Sucker Punch me. I think they're just going to double. Okay. So this isn't the end of the world. I do have Fake Out Pressure next turn. So I get in my Basket Legion, in my Rillaboom, and here, what I can actually do is, I'm going to say it's uh, my best shot of winning here. Um, Their Sucker Punch would go before my Aqua Jet because I have Rain up. But they also might not even Sucker Punch because they should expect to be slower than me. So my play here is just going to be to go for this. Um, I think I have to last respect the Glacier and go for a fake out into Urshifu and just hope for the best. Or no, is there another option here? I could just not fake out the Urshifu and KO it with my Rillaboom. You know what? Screw it. Hard read. All right, they Wicked Blow there. Cool. Last Respects is at max power. And my only out here now is... I have one turn left of this. All right, so they I still haven't revealed that I have Aqua Jet, so they shouldn't Sucker Punch yet. I have to get this Aqua Jet crit. Oh, no, they one-shot me. All right, GG. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I mean, that's that's certainly a game I would have appreciated knowing if they had Trick Room, um, but it is what it is. Also knowing what kind of Urshifu they, they were. All right. <clears throat> Looks like we're facing just Chalk. New Chalk is the best way to put it. Let's see. Yes, okay. A cultured player. Flame Orb, Normal, Facade, Earthquake, Headlong Rush. Okay, interesting running um, two Ground Stabs. Safety Goggles, Cresselia, Terra Fairy. Rapid Strike, Urshifu. Okay, um, what's the item on the Cresselia? Well, cool. I can Taunt it, so I am going to lead off with my Taunt guy. And... Actually, Basket Legion lead isn't that bad here. Yeah, yeah. Basket Legion lead is not bad at all. Um, I think I also want my Golden Go for the end game, but I'm not certain. I think Pelipper is not that bad. 
Let's go with like Rillaboom here and Champal. Let's do that. All right, nice. So they are Terra Normal on their Ursa Luna. Can I one shot this Cresselia? Is that a thing I can do? I could just taunt it too, but I'm kind of scared they might just helping hand and like one shot my whole team. I suppose the middle ground play would be to taunt and immediately Terra Water Wave Crash. Cool. Ursaluna's burnt. They do have to make a defensive switch, and nothing wants to eat this, so I am just going to rain dance and go for it again. Uh, they don't have... Like, even the Amoongus should be taking upwards of, like, 60% from this. As they just sack the Ursaluna. That's big for me. Cool. I'm going to take a lot of recoil, though. They Moonblast me. No worries. By the way, guys, this is going to be a bit of a shorter video. I don't really have a lot of time to record today. I have enough where I can do this. Um, I'm actually just going to go ahead and go for a Wild Bolt Storm and Protect here. I don't really have a reason to swap. Um, this Iron Hand shouldn't be able to one-shot me. And even if it like does somehow one-shot my Thunderous, um, I can just get in Chen Pao and one-shot the Cresselia. So we'll Wild Bolt Storm here and Protect. Decent chunk of damage. And honestly, I think I... Oh, we get the para on him. Honestly, I think my win con here is one-shotting that Cresselia and preventing Trick Room. Um, I don't really care about the Iron Hands anymore. So I'm actually going to get in the Chen Pao. And let's just see how much this Wave Crash does to Cress. I'm really invested in this one. I'm really invested in this attack right here. It's gone. It's gone. It's It's been eliminated. Get full para here. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, there's Heatran. Um, do they have Protect on this? It's AV probably, right? Yeah, it's AV. Heatran does have Protect. So it is in my best interest to... Um, I mean, I win regardless, I think, if I hold on to my Heatran. Here, what, what I'm, or if I hold on to my, my Basket Legion. So I'm just going to put on pressure here. I'm going to go for Ice Spinner into the Iron Hands. And we're just going to wave crash you, Tran. Who cares? Yeah, no, I'm not going to make that call. Let's just get rid of it. Ice Spinner's not going to one-shot. Getting the rule. Actually, it's getting thunderous. Why not? It's 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 more fun to click uh, Wild Bolt Storm. It's more fun to click that move. Nice. Okay. As we're facing Chen Pao, or not Chen Pao, Wo Chen. Oh, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a fake believer. Wo Chen plus Gudra. Probably going to be that Shelter Body Press Gudra set. Um, Let's see. Daniel Acorn, what you got for me? Oh, it's Covert Cloak. Yeah, it is the Acid Armor. Luckily, that's what Haze Chen Pao is for. And also, we can just really, really hammer into this guy with the Golden Go, as well as, you know, we have Taunt. The only thing is we can't immediately Taunt you because you are Dark type. Um, I get a lot of value out of just getting rid of you, to be honest. What's your Terra on you? Okay, so it is it is Terra Ghost on the Grimmsnarl, so I can't immediately fake it out. But I can force it to Terra. And I can still get a KO. I think I have to lead off with, like, Rillaboom Golden Go. I need Chen Pao for the end game, Or maybe I do bring Thunderous on lead. Maybe Thunderous on lead still isn't a bad play. Yeah, I mean, I can I can get a lot done with this, I think. Let's do that. Okay, that's basically the lead I was hoping for. Um, I know that they're going to want to go for a... What's it called? I know that they're, they're going to want to go for a uh, silly goofy move, whatever it was called, the light screen. I don't think they're, they're going to Terra here. So I can actually end game with Chen Pao. Um, and this, I, I have to tear here because I need to get rid of the, I need to get rid of the Grimmsnarl before I can go for any, uh, any screens or anything. So, uh, what I'm going to do here is actually just Wild Bolt Storm and make it rain. And I can trick this Gudra later on in the game. So let's Terra Steel immediately to make sure Grimmsnarl goes down. That is not a switch in, sir. It, this is not going to enjoy the hit. 
Full para right here. Ready? No para? All right, that's fine. It's still not enjoying this hit. Yeah, okay, yeah. And he only got that off. Um, unfortunately, this is another ter uh, This is another dark type, so I can't prankster attack it. Uh, but, 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 what I can do here now is I think I want to go for a thunder wave into you. Actually, I could just rain dance immediately and get in Basque Legion. Let's just do that. Yeah, even if they like get rid of my Basque Legion, Golden Go Endgame is still really nice because I can just trick the Gudra. You know, on second thought, maybe I shouldn't have Terrid. Oh, there's Life Dew. Hello. Hi, Life Dew. I don't think you eat this hit. If I'm being real with you, I don't think that the Roaring Moon is going to eat this hit very well. Let's go for a Wild Bolt Storm as well as a Wave Crash into you. And if I can trick this Gudra, um, it's it's over. Because my Basque Legion will hard, will hard wall it. Alright, Para. Nope, okay, cool. So, what's my flow chart for this now? I think what I need to do... There's Wo Chen. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Chen Pao Endgame seems really good. Um, let's go ahead and... Taunt Gudro. We'll get in Golden Go here. Because they're never going to body press into this slot. They might foul play actually maybe it's better to go golden go onto the left slot for that reason and we'll get in Chen Pao here yeah yeah I'm glad I didn't do that okay cool they don't have protect so I'm gonna trick them and also go for haze and they shouldn't really have an answer to that anymore see what they got I think that they recognize what's about to happen and they're like oh dang it <laughs> I think they know what's about to go down there's the Terra water cool trick you pollen puff doesn't KO me they body press, nice. So now they're tricked into body press, so I can just focus down Wo Chen. Um, and that's my win con. So I'm gonna get in Thunderous here and I'm gonna protect. And I need to just spam Wild Bolt Storm. That's my win con. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. Cool. Uh let's go ahead and what's the Wo Chen's moveset? I'm going to taunt this thing and I think I have to lose my Chen Pao this turn, but that's fine because I just beat it. Yeah. Let's go for Ice Spinner into you for damage because I think that they're just going to want to. Oh, okay. A little bit of damage there. I'll play. Oh, that actually did more than I was hoping for. Ooh, that is not good. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I don't like that. All right. Wild Bolt Storm. <laughs> I may have underestimated how much damage that foul play was going to do. All right, let's get rid of Gudra first. That is... Yeah, yeah, because I can beat Wo Chen. All right. Wild Boat Storm. Hopefully I don't miss. Ice Spinner. Nice. I hit the Wo Chen. I wanted to hit that more than anything, to be honest. In Basket Legion, Golden Go. Um, I can use Basket Legion to KO this Gudra. And I go for last respects into you, and I, t I think two Thunderbolts should do it onto Wo Chen. Yeah. Last respects KOs you. They're going to have to foul play me. Nice. Two Thunderbolts. Because the last one did how much? 41%. That's going to be a roll, but uh, they have to land a Leech Seed, and even then, I don't think they outstall me. Yeah. Thunderbolt. I'm also Covert Cloak. I could take their leftovers if it gets too bad, but I think it's better just to Thunderbolt twice. No, I just get the high roll. Cool. GG. Whoops. Nice. All 
All right, this is pretty cool. I would assume this is Terra Water. Or not Terra Water. I would assume this is Water Urshifu. So versus Water Urshifu. Um, let me think. I think that my Rillaboom or my Thunderous Lead is actually really solid because I always get off my Rain Dance. Um, I don't know if I need Tailwind to win, really. I think what I can do is. I can lead off with like Thunderous here and Golden Go to force them to need to focus down Specs Golden Go, but also they don't know it's Specs because, you know, they're not going to open up the team sheet. Uh, I'm going to go Basca Legion in the back here and Shen Pao. Okay. So, like I said, I have no idea what the Terra type on this Dragonite is. It is what it is. Um, let's go ahead and just go for this Rain Dance immediately. I want to make sure I don't not get that Rain Dance off. And I think that my Thunder should be able to eat one hit. <laughs> I hope. Let me check that EV spread again. Oh, where'd I put it? All right. Max HP, four to... You can eat one hit, bro. There's no way you don't eat one hit. All right. And I'm going to go ahead and just... The reason to Terra anything else here? Probably not. Terra still make it rain. Do I want to open up with that? No, because I don't want to get... Yeah, we'll just go for a raw make it rain. Good damage under Dragonite. That's definitely not multi-skill. I mean, Tantrum. Nice. Cool. Uh, let me go for my Wild Bolt Storm. That'll do a decent amount into both of these guys. I could also Terra Grass right now take minimum minimum damage but i don't know if it's worth it let's just wild bolt storm and i'm willing to toss off another one to be honest the u-turn on me okay cool please send in the dragonite again i would really like that let's go <laughs> all right cool para i got a pair on the urshifu which is actually really big because now i can go into my i can go into my uh Basque legion and my play here is... Oh, do I actually go Chen Pao, maybe? No, I go Basque Legion here. Because he's within Aqua Jet range. So I go for... Um, I go for another Wild Boat Storm. And I just Aqua Jet the Urshifu to KO. I would assume that's within Aqua Jet range. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm crazy. I'm just going to assume it's within Wild Boat. I think that Aqua Jet even resisted in the rain from this guy with a Life Orb. Yeah, no, that's KOing. That's KOing. If it doesn't KO, I'm just crazy. I'm, I am actually crazy, unfortunately. No, we're good. I'm good at the game. Sorry, I passed the skill check. <laughs> I passed the skill check. Don't worry, guys. Cool. Um, so what I can do here is I still have two turns of rain. I actually want to preserve my my Chen Pao or my uh, my Thunderous. Um, and I want to bait out a protect from possibly the Zapdos. And I'm going to have to tear a water, I think. Because he's going to sucker punch me. Throat chop. Interesting. Wild charge that. Okay, that is that is something I have not ever thought of. All right, can I eat this hit? I think if I tear, I can eat this hit and then I just win. Um, let's go for a sucker punch into you. And I'm going to Terra not lose my guy in wave crash I can also double the Zapdos but if he goes for Tailwind I lose oh awesome they Terra ghosted and they also didn't Sucker Punch by Basket Legion do you just not have Sucker Punch? I figure you would have clicked it there Sacred Sword nice they lose to Aqua Jet now if I Rain Dance Yeah, my play is actually Rain Dance Protect Aqua Jet. And the reason this is the play is because if they sucker punch my Basket Legion and I miss a Wild Bolt Storm, I lose. So, <laughs> yeah, so I Rain Dance Protect and then next turn Aqua Jet, and that's a win. Because I have to outspeed to get my move to go first. They might just have not revealed Sucker Punch. If they have it, they'll, they'll reveal it this turn because you always click it now.
they're thinking they're like how do i get out of this one hmm? how do i how do i get out of this uh sticky situation my friend i have the stickiest basket legion yep they do have it there it is they were thinking about it <laughs> all right wild bolt storm aqua jets now a guaranteed win i hit him with that gg well played they have no outs anymore good game because now i'm faster than them so my priority move goes first i knew they had it i was like if they have this move they have to click it you know <laughs> Basket Legion does insane damage, though. I, I have to be honest, guys. This is, like, one of my favorite Pokemon this gen. All right, Rocks Debuggy. All right, One Piece Theorist. You're not going to click your move, are you? That's fine. That's fine. You're just increasing the runtime of my video. Everyone, comment. Total garbage. Oh, me What you think about the last chapter... By the way. Of One Piece. <laughs> See, this is this is how I turn around on him. This is how I this is how I get him to like not be mad anymore and just be like, oh One Piece fan. Look, if you're gonna have a One Piece alt, you're totally gonna want to talk about One Piece. You're totally gonna want to talk about One Piece with me. No, he, he doesn't. He doesn't want to talk about one piece with me. Thank you. All right. Let's do one more. Ooh. 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 I, I, I hope I rage quit. Honestly, this team's kind of heat. I hope I rage quit. <laughs> Please open up the team sheet, sir. I already know that's got Trick Room. My 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 game theory is that is Trick Room on the on the Gardakuno. There's Gardakuno, Goltris, and Gapdos. Those are the three names. Um, but you got the wrong Zapdos. So, if my brain is correct, and they are gonna want to go for that that Trick Room, Thunderous Lead goes crazy, as well as Basket Legion. This Pelipper is not going to show up. This Pelipper is like the least important member of the team. He might he might get swapped out. I'm not going to lie. Um, I get a lot of value out of Chen Pao still, even though they have, you know, that. Um, I think I still go Pel I think this is the one and only Pelipper game. Is this really going to be the one and only Pelipper game? Let's go ahead and I'm going to Rain Dance and Protect. Actually, do I Rain Dance? I could just Wild Bolt Storm and Thunder Wave. You know, let's Thunder Wave the Flutterman and Protect. Just a Scout. Just a Scout. Because if they do want to go into that Grass type... Are you going to Trick Room? Is this the Trick Room turn? I called it! I knew it! I'm crazy! Alright. Alright, alright, that's fine. That's fine. Cool. Um, Let me also Thunder Wave you. And... So now the issue is it's gonna be faster than me. I could side thunder wave and try to one shot what comes in, but I already know that's not the play. Let's just wild boat storm, man. Hidden champ, how? Why not? I have to hold on to my water type. Cool. Poggers. Big damage. That is massive damage. All right, check it out. He's never gonna see this play coming, but it's gonna blow his mind. He's gonna. He's about to have his mind blown. Let me think. Is he faster than me? Uh, two hundred five divided by two. It's gonna be what, like one o one o two in this game? Yeah. All right, check this out. A mind blowing play from the from the creator of the world's greatest team. Are you kidding me? <laughs> what? I had him. Oh my God. You're kidding me. There's no way. There's no way. Come on, man. All right. All right. Uh, I just lose now, don't I? All 
All right. Uh, and yeah, I'm Terra Water too, so it's not like. All right, I have to side Thunder Wave again. That's the only out I have. It is legitimately the only out I have in last respects. Come on. All right, cool. Oh, he still has discharge. He's slower than me still. That's insane. Cool. All right, we have a shot. Rain dance. <laughs> No, I may have freaked it by not getting that KO. I kind of needed that KO before he could move. All right. Got to Aqua Jet here and hope for the most, the most hacks possible. All right, GG, well played. That was a very messy game. And I'm honestly kind of annoyed that um, I didn't get that side uh, that side para because I actually I actually think that would have put me in a decent position to win because uh, I would have kept all my tools. But it's whatever. Uh, I think we won most of the games this video. I think we only lost two: one at the beginning, one at the end, and it was sandwiched with a, a it was it was sandwiching a whole bunch of dubs. So we'll take it. You know, I like this team quite a bit. I think it's very fun. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.